what is up guys welcome back to a new video here on the channel in this video i'll show you how to install mods for f1 manager 2024 uh, i just want to say first off it's quite easy uh, it's just drag and drop so don't you worry but i will still show you in this video so before we begin i just want to say i just posted my custom creators team sponsors pack i have a video out as well showing you how to make your own but if you don't want to make your own and mess around in photoshop and find my logos i have posted my own here it's called the yeah obviously micro gb create a team sponsors pack and it's currently in version one i have some things i want to change which i said here um somewhere yeah i want to change the visa and aramco um because those are included and they obviously sponsor f1 teams already um but yeah it doesn't matter yeah uh, you can read through this if you'd like and then if you go to the images you will see here uh, some of the features i talked about and here you can you see all of the logos or kind of all of the logos the logos that are here are the monochrome logos um which is the ones you can change colors on some of them you can change colors on not the ones with with color uh, but the others uh, that are fully white you can change uh, change colors and some of these for an example uh, jbl apple tv uh, noco airbus patek philippe aramco ferrari visa chase dell ralph lauren m m more m definitely more than half of these you can change logos so for an example with the nvidia here you can either have the nvidia logo before the name or like this and then you can have either amazon.com or you can have this prime logo but enough of promoting my own sponsor pack if you do not want um my sponsor pack you're gonna go to the other link which is to overtake.gg this is what was a uh, race department before um, but it is now called overtake.gg and to f1 manager 2024 mods and then you can filter here if you want the most downloaded mods you can have them here so for example if you want this extended ui here uh, you're just gonna go uh, and click it and then click download this is an amazing mod by the way i love it i use it um, so you can see you have all of the information obviously the leaderboard gets bigger and wider but uh, I have no problem with that. I think it's really nice to use. Um, and then if you go to sectors now, you can actually see everything. Uh, which you can see the sector times instead of just uh, the colors, which I really like. But I'm going to show you guys how to install my sponsor pack, obviously, because I'm going to have to promote it. Okay, so just choose your mod and then hit this big download button. And something I forgot to disclose, you will need a overtake.gg account it's very easy right here where my profile is there should be a register button just you just click that and then no need to pay okay scroll down and then it will say basic account or something and you will not have to pay okay don't pay anything unless you want to support it of course but if you don't want to pay don't pay because you don't have to anyways click download and then just save it or whatever anywhere it's gonna download as a zip file most likely with everything and now what you're gonna want to do is navigate to your game folder which you will do by going to steam right clicking your game uh, and then go to managed and manage and browse local files what will open now is um, this folder right here f1 manager 2024 it opens in something like steam apps common f1 manager 2024 um, if you have it on epic games you're gonna have to locate where epic games is so maybe on your hard drive or on your c drive um, but yeah and then you go to epic games and uh, f1 manager should just be there Anyways, the folder structure is the same, so don't worry about that. Go into F1 Manager 2024, then go to F1 Manager 24. 
go to content and packs. And you're going to have a bunch of weird files that say pack chunk something something windows dot pack UCAS and UTOC. This is not something you need to care about unless you obviously want to mod the game. I will make videos on that. Uh, obviously, you can check out my video if you want to make your own sponsor pack um, on how to do that. We have a I have a video on that. If you'd like to know, you're not going to need to touch these files. There's tools for everything to open them and stuff like that. Now we're going to open our little zip file here. Um, and there is four files. There is the sponsor names. There is the sponsors pack. There's sponsor UCS and sponsors UTOC. So just select all of the files and drag them in here. Now you are done with installing them. So what we're going to do is we're going to launch the game. And I'm going to see you guys in game and we'll see if it works. But I did earlier when I tried it out the mod before I uploaded it is that I just created a create a team so you can do that as well or if you're mid season uh, not mid season if you're done a season uh, or actually that doesn't matter because it just changes your logos uh, so don't worry about that you can install the pack whenever in the season so now you can see here that when we click sponsor negotiation we have three real life sponsors these are title sponsors. I realize now, now that Gillette may not be that um, realistic to have as a title sponsor. I don't know if it is or not. Um, but uh, yeah. Then we have PayPal and Autodesk. And just something I want to say is some of these um, categories here. Technology, manufacturing, energy, drinks and so on. Might not be uh, correct uh, with the company. But I f thought that the only time you ever, ever see this is uh, here in the menus. I didn't want to spend time finding um, something uh, like, for example, Gillette. The, I don't see the... There is already Celsius and uh, Monster and stuff in uh, F1. They already sponsor teams. So I didn't want to... First of all, I didn't want to have those... Uh, uh, th those brands but I also um, I didn't want to have some small uh, some small uh, company or whatever I, d I thought that it's better to have good good brands maybe or um, yeah I just thought these brands fit better but obviously Gillette maybe more likely to sponsor as a uh, side sponsor or an, uh, as it's called in the game optional but we're going to choose paypal as our um as our title sponsor then we have the optional sponsor and here you have a lot of them we have nine of them and this also um this is i just clicked through the creator teams so i don't actually know my team rating or anything like that um but Obviously, there will be different sponsors depending on sponsors depending on how good your team is. But yeah, let's take Hugo Boss, Apple TV. Let's take maybe Shopify and Saudi Aramco. Click confirm, confirm again, and now comes the exciting part, which is the actual um, delivery crate. And keep in mind, some of these might be a bit too big and stuff. You can see this PayPal logo on the side pod here is way too big. So you're going to have to scale that. Um, maybe that's too small. So you can scale it like this. And the thing with this, with my mod, is that um, I don't know what we're going to show. Let's take Aramco here for an example. So here we have the Aramco text with the Aramco logo. Um, so what I'm going to do is if I click color here, you can choose between full color and silhouette, which is what I called monochrome earlier. That's what the thumbnails show. Uh, I'm going to show you guys the thumbnails soon. Um, they show the uh, silhouette or monochrome logos. 
The reason I call it monochrome is because in the game files they are called monochrome. Uh, so then we can change that, move it, maybe scale it down a bit, move it further. Um, so that's a quite unique, I hope at least it's unique for my sponsor pack, that we have multiple logos. So for an example, on the rear wing, that's not the rear wing, here we have the rear wing. This PayPal logo is, as you can see here, it's with the logo on top and then the name on the bottom. But that wouldn't fit that well um, on the rear wing because then we'd have to have it like this big. But if we go to color and make it a silhouette, I just want to mention something that when these have colors, um, the silhouette, you can't change the color like you can with other sponsors. So I did some logos is like that and I did... I I had it. I decided for it to be like that because I don't think PayPal would look good if you change it to red or anything else. So yeah, now we can scale it up and that looks significantly be better. Also, these little weird things here, I think that's a bug in the game because I've seen it um, other times as well and it looks really weird uh, with basically any spawn. And now, for an example, this is something I like. Maybe Apple want to, here on the back, they want to promote big Apple TV, like buy Apple TV or whatever. Uh, scale it down. Like that. Um, but on the front here, they want to have a more, uh, maybe not low-key, but if we say on the... Yeah, here, up on the, maybe, the side of the halo here. Oh, actually, that's stupid, because that logo is uh, black. Um, Let's say, let's take on the front wing, then. Because, or let's take the side. I don't know. We can take this uh, spot somewhere up here. Then maybe here, they want to have Apple TV+. Plus. So we have Apple TV here, and then we have Apple TV+, Plus right there. Which I I really like that you can do that, and I think that's quite an amazing feature for my mod. Also, this livery, livery looks good, except for this, and also obviously this. So, yeah, I, I'm sorry, this video may be 90% promoting my sponsor pack and 10% showing you how to install mods, but it's so easy to install the mods, so it's already done. Uh, don't worry, if you're still watching, I'm grateful for that, and I hope you're gonna install my mod. Um, But let's say, let's check the front wing here. Um, if we take Hugo Boss, that doesn't look that good in black on black. So we're going to change it to silhouette. Obviously that changes the logo and there is a slight problem. You can't have the main logo. You can't change color of it. Of it. Um, and I've kind of thought about that. And then I thought, um, or I decided that the logo that I think you would use Maybe in most, but the logo that would be uh, um, in most places, maybe, um, that has to be kind of universal or whatever we're going to call it. Um, damn, this logo, look, uh, this livery looks good. Um, that's the one you would want to change the colors on. But here, for an example, we have Shopify. That doesn't work that well uh, with the logo and uh, the actual brand name are we gonna scale it down a bit so you can have just the logo but that wouldn't be that fitting of a sponsor on the front wing then. the last thing i want to show you guys is a feature that is i have seen some sponsor packs have it but not in the way that i have made it so if we we have the Four. Sorry, we're not gonna make these intersect here. Let me pick it up. Uh, we have all four engine manufacturers. So we have Ferrari, we have Renault, Mercedes, and Honda. And you can see in these thumb, this is the thumbnails I was talking about. Um, but yeah, 
Um, so for Ferrari, for an example, you can have either the Ferrari logo to promote your um, your power unit manufacturer, or you can have this. Uh, I thought you could change colors. I, I yeah, you can change colors on this one apparently. That's a bug, an issue by me. I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to fix that. Um, but you can either have this Ferrari logo or the one that we are better familiar with. Same with Renault, you can have either this newer one or this one with the older logo and the text. Um, and then you can have Honda with the Honda logo and Honda text. Maybe you want the, this logo on the side here uh, or here or something, I don't know. In a more low-key place. And then you can have the, only the Honda, uh, Honda text. But my favorite is Mercedes, which on my uh, actual custom team, I made it. So I had a bunch of sponsors here, including Pirelli, which I have added. Pirelli, obviously, all of the, um, the F1 teams have, because that's the official uh, tire uh, supplier. So you're going to have to have that. That is included with my mod, which I'm also going to show you guys a special little feature. So just wait minute for that so you can have the mercedes logo right there and then let's say on the side pod let's say right here we want to promote what it is powered by an amg engine so we can put amg here which i think looks really good also let's say it doesn't fit in white which i think it does quite nicely here you can change it to red you can change it to pink you can ch oh sorry you need to bring this up Change it to any color you want, which I really like. Now the last thing, of course, uh, we're gonna go here. What spot should we do? Let's say the Apple TV. So we're just gonna change that, and you won't. No, you will find Pirelli. Sorry, but when you click it, you will see P0, and then you change to silhouette, and you will have Pirelli. You can change it to red or yellow or whatever you want. Um, but I really like it because uh, you can, I didn't see, like, why would you want a Pirelli logo in one color? I th I've thought of that with all logos. Like, why would you want one which is already decided a color and then you can change the color? Why can't you just have two different ones? Which is amazing that it works. Um, but, um, here we have Pirelli. And then, let's say you want to have Pirelli there. And then you want to sponsor their, uh, the actual tires. As you can see, these are P0 tires. So we're going to put that up on the halo here. We're going to have Pirelli and... Uh, wait, where? I don't even know where it is that it's placed. What? Okay. Maybe... We, oh, okay, sorry, it's in black. I forgot. I thought it was... What is it? I thought it was in white, so maybe we should place that. Maybe we could place it where the AMG logo is. And change? No, because that's also black surface. I'm stupid. I don't think that. All right. Let's put it on the side of the rear wing instead. Maybe you don't want to do that, do that, but yeah. You can have P0 there like that. I think it's quite a nice feature. Instead of having a worthless Pirelli, basically, that's just a decided color. Um, you can get that color anyways if you just use the the, the color selection, which is uh, here. Um, so I think it's much better to just have two different colors. But yeah, sorry for promoting my mod for basically the bigger part of this video. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope you guys learned something. Uh, but yeah, thank you for watching. I will see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe, leave a like on the video. Goodbye. Hold me close till I get up. Time is barely on our side. I don't wanna waste what's left. The storms we chase are leading us.